Hunger across the U.S. is way up again, but as food costs continue to soar, food pantries are having a tough time meeting demand. Aliyah Keller joins us live in the 7 News studio now to tell us why food pantries are falling behind and how you can help. Aliyah. Catherine and Steve, the lines are getting longer at food banks, but this time not from COVID-19, but from inflation. However, food banks are struggling to keep up more so than ever before. The director of the Marshall County Family Resource Network, Stacy Dye, says a number of donors, support systems, and help from the government helped out during COVID-19, but those services have since run out. It's left many food banks short-handed. That's why Dai is asking for help from the community. I think the, the most impactful thing that people can do when they feel like they want to support an issue or an organization is contact them and say, what things do you need? So I think asking the organization and making sure that you're tapping into what they need, what they need to get to families, and how they need to do it. Di also says it's not just homeless communities that now need help from food pantries, it's everyone. That includes single parents, seniors, or people who are just trying to get by. Now, if you'd like to donate or get help yourself, just go to the website right there on your screen. Live in the 7 News studio, Aliyah Keller working for you.